everybody, welcome. Welcome to another edition of this channel. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for all the new subscriptions, guys. I really, really appreciate it. Go ahead and uh, give me that thumbs up uh, before you watch this video. And if you haven't subscribed, please do so. Uh, thank you to everybody who's shared the video. Uh, I really appreciate it. I'm going to jump on this whole top buys of 2023 uh the best things i got in 2023 um what are we calling this list best gets or best buys um the coolest things i got in 2023 i'm just going to share some highlights some things that really stood out i'm going to start with uh with this one here and i want to thank everybody who tuned in to uh to watch the video that i did on this, uh, the White Stripes 20th anniversary on Third Man Records Mono Edition. Uh, I did a, a, a video on this and I talked about the release of the UHQR. Uh, didn't do a comparison because I didn't get the UHQR. I got this. And uh, it's the most viewed video on my channel. So thank you. I don't know if you guys are tuning in to watch this. Or tuning in to see my my chest uh, you guys <laughs> I'm really embarrassed about that video I don't know why I can't you know realize that you know you know there's there's such thing as take two you know I could have done this all over again I was using a microphone okay I I had this this thing here which I don't use anymore I just use you know the mic here and uh, I clipped it on, and as the video went on, it just kept getting lower and lower and lower, and you could, you know, see my chest. I, I don't know. It's embarrassing. But thanks for tuning in. It's my most viewed video. <laughs> so this is uh, one of the top gets of 2023. This is a really, really cool way to, to release a, a special edition of, of a record. You know, it's not a big, giant, clunky box like that. Real simple, man. It's a little booklet simple opens up boom you got your you got your discs here and of course they came on you know red and white of course and then you've got supplemental material here you've got a booklet and you also have a dvd uh, with this thing this thing also came with a 45 all right a 45 sorry there, 45 on this candy, candy red uh, color here. Really nice. And if you haven't seen this video or my chest, uh, go ahead and uh, I'll leave the, the link in the description to this one. Uh, there's also this really cool uh, certificate that Third Man puts out with uh, all their stuff. Really nice. Uh, yeah, that, that was a good find this year. And that's part of... Um, of a membership for third man records all right i also got i got this from them yeah, they released this this year fearless miles davis this big mess of a performance at the fillmore or if you're into this um it's pretty cool i mean it, it's a wild wild performance also from third man records but uh yeah that's the first one right there uh the 20th anniversary of uh, of Elephant by the White Stripes mono version on Third Man Records is definitely a top get for this year. Another box set, or I think it's kind of like a box set, is uh, this. This was a cool find. This is a Thundercats album, Drunk, but it's presented on a bunch of uh, 10 inches, right? Let me open this up here. Instead of putting the album on, you know, I think that's a double LP. It's on all these 10 inches. It's on how many? Hold on a minute here. One, two, three, four, five 10 inches. And they've all got, you know, cat things on them. All right? I'm oh, sorry. Yeah, cat things. Thunder cat. And they all come on. Sorry, just getting here. 
They all come on red vinyl. All right. Really cool way of presenting the album. If uh, you know if you're not into this sort of thing, well then you know just buy the the regular album. But I think Thundercat is pretty cool, and they just basically separate. They separated uh, this album into these ten inches. Just another way of presenting the album and buying it in this cool box set. All right, that was a cool find this year. What else, man? Here's in the spirit of that Thundercat album. I found this uh, Cramps record. All right, this is Smell Female. This is basically uh, this album right here, but on 45s. Kind of the same thing uh, that they did with Thundercat. I don't know, so you might think, you know, well, what's the point of that? What's what's the point of, you know, instead of just having one of these, why would you want to have four of these? Well, why not? <laughs> It's just a cool way of uh, collecting that album. This is a limited edition. Uh, I've got number 4,026. I'm not sure how many of these they made. Um, I mean, it's this is worth maybe like about 20 bucks, I think. Um, I just got it because I thought it was a cool way of uh, presenting this album on 45s. And they're on different colors here. It's white. What else? Black. Right? What else? Oh, look at that. Cool, huh? And last but not least, blue. Really cool. Nice, collectible, uh, and they sound good. So that was a cool uh, get. And another Cramps record. Uh, that I got, that I found uh, this year, was uh, this compilation. This is Off the Bone, and it's the 3D cover. And it's not only the 3D cover, guys, but it has the 3D glasses. Oh, yeah. I wish I could do the 3D effect here, like, for you guys. I don't know if that'll... Would that work? <laughs> I mean, there's the there's the cover, and I don't know. no, sorry, I tried. Anyways, it looks cool. Um, <laughs> yeah, there's uh, Lux Interiors holding out that um, that knife like right at you. It's like <sighs> pretty cool. Poison Ivy's there in the back. Cool cover. Anyways, that was a good find this year. Cramps off the bone 3D cover. This is it's a compilation. How do you guys like these sleeves, huh? These inner sleeves. They're anti-static, but they're like see-through. And then you know I could just put them in like this. They're just like Mofi sleeves, but without the the white stuff there. They're see-through. Anyhow, cramps off the bone. Cool find in 2023 um rock in espanol all right i want you guys to tune into my next video it's going to be all about rock in espanol uh super expensive man you know I, I i'm not sure why but i haven't been able to find anything within reason within a reasonable price and so i took to ebay and I found some stuff on eBay, all legit, it all worked out, it all checked out. And I got myself a copy of this, all right? And thank you for everybody who's been asking about it because it's been in the background. This is Mecano, all right? From Spain, 80s Spanish rock uh, pop trio headed by uh, Anna, Anna Torroja, who, who still performs nowadays as a soloist. Uh, recording within various genres but this was a pop group uh, really cool songs iconic voice you know she had this really cute pixie like voice um, their big song Cruz de Navajas uh, translation razor blade cross uh, was a huge hit 
in the mid 80s i remember hearing it as a little kid and uh i mean they're legends spanish rock legends i have not been able to find a copy of this here in the states i found one last year at a record show okay it was sealed it was still in the shrink and the shrink was hanging on for dear life the whole thing was like bent I mean, you could see the record like this, but the, the sleeve was like bent. So I look at the price up here and it said, I saw a three and a six. So I said, okay, cool. You want 36 bucks? You know, it's unopened. It looks thrashed, but I guess that's a fair price. He's like, no, 36? Uh-uh. It's 360 bucks. And I find Spanish rock like that all the time. It is just sky high through the roof. You guys... I found these on eBay. This is a Spanish copy and this is a Mexican copy, all right? 26, 23. There it is. I haven't done the the shootout, which one's better. I heard the Mexican copy is better. They it's just mastered a little different. I don't know why the Spanish one wouldn't be, but I'm going to do a shootout and tune into my next video, guys. It's going to be all about rock in español. Um great record here. Great find. We're very excited to have this um, Mecano. And speaking of cute and pixie-like voices, here's uh, another one. Uh, this is a copy of No Doubt's Tragic Kingdom on that spider web vinyl. I never seen this. I didn't even know it existed. Saw it on whatnot. Got a great freaking price for it. Isn't that cool, guys? Um, I love No Doubt. Never had a copy of Tragic Kingdom. There it is. Um, Spiderweb. Vinyl. Another cute voice. Amy Mann. You saw this on my last video on the Orange County Record Show video. If you haven't seen that, go check it out. The description or the, the link to that will be in the description. This is a great album. Charmer. This thing uh, spins around and it comes on orange vinyl. Look at that. Gorgeous. Great album. Sounds great. Got it at the Orange County Record Show from Audiophile USA. They wanted 29 bucks for it, but I gave them 25 Great buy. What's so, next? Uh, another great find this year is from, from Vinyl Me Please. I resubscribed to them again, and I'm probably going to do a, a Vinyl Me Please video, so stay tuned for that. Vinyl Me Please, the monthly club uh subscription uh i recommend it uh you know it's it, it's it's really cool they they send you out an essential album or an album they feel is essential for your collection and one of the cool surprises was this guy right here uh acid by ray barreto uh this is a, a great copy of this album it's a mono copy uh, the 55th anniversary edition of Barreto's Latin Soul Classic uh, AAA cut. Uh, cut from uh, the original Mono Master Tapes by Ryan Smith at Sterling Sound. Um, really cool record, man. I mean, this thing sounds great. And it comes in this really cool, you know, package. Vinyl Me Please always includes a... A uh, piece of art with their monthly uh, selections. This is original artwork by Clay Condor. All right. Um, looks like some psychedelic uh, stuff going on there. And uh, this is a really cool cover, man. They did a great job with this. This is like a tip-on style jacket. Uh, really nice, really sturdy. Uh, of course, uh, these are... These are numbered, and you know, it has the little VMP essentials, and this comes on, gotta show the vinyl, comes on this, you know, like lava or acid fire, what are they calling it? They always, they always give cool names to this, um, what does it come on here, huh? What are they calling it? What are they calling it? Pressed on orange smoke vinyl is what they're calling it. <laughs> Alright, so there it is. Orange smoke vinyl. They re 
produced the the label there kind of you know Fania Fania Records the um, the label that uh, Ray Barreto was on and then they kind of did it right there really cool this thing sounds great guys this is one of the really cool finds of this year I didn't know I was gonna get it in the vinyl me please uh, you know selections you know they give you the option to swap things out right uh, but they give you a time limit and I miss that time limit and I'm glad because I don't know if I would have uh, switched this out but uh, here comes with a booklet talks about you know Ray Barreto and um, how his music's been used in a lot of movies um, like Ed Watusi has been used in countless films you know Scorsese's used that Oliver Stone's used that that song and this thing one of the great finds of 2023 for me the vinyl me please version of acid by ray barreto what else did i get oh yeah check this out a copy of serone 3 all right you guys know serone serone is a, a french disco drummer producer i'm gonna leave the link to take me all right video here on youtube um check out that cover man they they don't make them like that anymore <laughs> i don't know what is going on there but um yeah this is disco music i'm looking for serone's paradise okay that's the one i really want this is serone three and like i said this is really cool disco music uh like i said serone was a drummer Looks like he didn't have a waist or a stomach either. <laughs> Looks like he's just chest and all legs right there. <laughs> but this is some really, really cool music. Uh, old school disco, funky, you know, funky disco. Uh, yeah, the drumming, uh, the percussions on, on this album, really cool. I still don't know what's going on with this cover, man. <laughs> But really cool, and Cerrone's still around, and I think he still does shows. Uh, really cool, Cerrone 3. That was a great find. Uh, I found a copy of The Walk, The Cure, 1983. The Walk was a, a single. came out as a standalone single. Uh, it wasn't on any album. And then they released it this way here in the States uh, as this six-cut mini lp and i've got you know the hype sticker there really cool huh uh 5.99 suggested price six cut mini lp this has the walk including an extended version of let's go to bed which is not featured on the european versions so that's a great find right there especially since i saw the cure this year at the hollywood bowl one of the greatest shows i've ever been to and uh, let's see what's what's next. Uh, here we go. Then the last one, guys. Last one. This was really fun to find. I found this on Whatnot. All right, the uh, the online auction app. If you haven't seen my video about Whatnot, I will leave the link to that into the in the description to this one. But anyways, uh, this is an album of you know Mexican trio music or boleros what they call uh, romantic songs and this is called um, Rio Calaveras all right the skeleton trio I can't believe the guy had this he didn't even know what he had he thought it was funny he's like uh, that's something in Spanish uh, there's this gold metal here in, in, inside I knew exactly what it was. My parents used to have this, but they don't have the copy anymore. So I found it. It's three LPs. It's uh, the the trio Calaveras is basically their greatest hits. And uh, yeah, check out that cover. Really nice. Uh, kind of beat up there on the corner, but this gold metal here, really nice. 
Uh, some of the songs on here, you know, Las Mañanitas, which is a popular song that gets sung during someone's birthday. Uh, Guadalajara, I mean, what else is on here? Allá en el Rancho Grande, Cielito Lindo. All these really famous Mexican um, trio songs, boleros, and like mariachi music. I got it for five dollars all right this is a cool get here for 2023 and i hope you enjoyed all my other finds and i hope you've enjoyed my channel and this video please share it thank you to everyone who's already shared it all the new subscriptions all the comments thank you very much guys subscribe i always subscribe back leave a comment i always reply have a great week, guys. See you next time.